Hi students, this is Alex here. In this problem, they have given A and B throw alternatively with a pair of dice. So when they throw pair of dice, we get the sample space S yes, as 1, 1, 1, 2 till 1, 6. In the same way, it continues 2, 1, 2, 2, dot, 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 and 3, 1, dot, 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 and finally, we get 6, 6. And totally, we have n of s as 36. But as per the question, a wins if e throw 6 before b throws 7. And B wins if he throw 7 before A throws 6. It means the sum 6, they meaning they throw 6, they throw 7, they meaning the sum of the elements. Suppose if I add these two, I get 7. So I have to write separately for A. It means for A throwing the sum, 6 is winning. The sum 6 will happen for these 1 comma 5, then 2 comma 4, then 3 comma 3, then 4 comma 2, then 5 comma 1. Similarly, for B the winning is getting sum as is 7. The possibilities are 1 comma 6, 2 comma 5. 3 comma 4, 4 comma 3, 5 comma 2 and 6 comma 1. So from this we can write the probability of A winning is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 out of 36 and probability of B winning is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 out of 36. After reducing it is 1 by 6. Now P of A dash is 1 minus P of A. So 1 minus 5 by 36 that gives 31 by 36. In the same way P of B dash is 1 minus P of B 1 minus 1 by 6 which is 5 by 6. Now in the question they are asking if A begins find his chance of winning. That is when A begins we have to find the product of A winning that game. So P of A winning if A starts. So we are going to write the different probabilities of winning that is different cases of A winning. When A first starts, if we get the success, he wins the game. So the game itself over. Or what can happen is, when A starts, he is not winning. So he is not getting the required probability of winning. That is P of A dash. Then B will get a chance because they throw the die alternatively. The starting itself it is given. A and B throw alternately with a pair of dice. So when B throw, he should not win because we are looking for A winning. Then again A will get a chance, then A wins. So this means A is winning in the first trial. This means A is winning in the second trial because this is the second chance. This is the first chance and this is the second chance. Or A can win in the third trial. So P of A dash. When A first starts, he fails. Then B gets the chance and B fails. A gets the chance and A fails. B gets the chance and B fails. And finally, when A gets the chance, he wins. So like this, it continues. So here, A wins in the third trial. In first two trial, he fails. And third trial, he wins. So he wins in the first trial. This is the second trial, this is the third trial. Like this, it keeps going. He can win the fourth trial or fifth trial. That's why it keeps going till infinity. Now we substitute the values. The A winning is 5 by 36. A not winning is 31 by 36. 
B not winning is 5 by 36 and A winning is 31 by sorry A winning is I substitute again A not winning is 31 by 36 B not winning is 5 by 6 here P of B dash then A winning is 5 by 36 then coming to the third term a not winning is 31 by 36, B not winning is 5 by 6, A not winning is 31 by 36, B not winning is 5 by 6 and finally A winning is 5 by 36. Like this our series continues. This is an infinite GP and we have a formula to find the sum that is sum of infinite GP is A by 1 minus R. A is the first term from the series we can take this as the first term which is 5 by 36 and R is term 2 divided by term 1. Term 2 is this entire term when I divide by this 5 by 36, 5 by 36 will get cancelled remaining will be 31 by 36 into 5 by 6 because the third term gets cancelled when I divide this entire term by this 5 by 36 gets cancelled so remaining will be 31 by 36 into 5 by 6 so we substitute here this is 5 by 36 whole divided by 1 minus r is 31 by 36 into 5 by 6 let's simplify the denominator so numerator 5 by 36 is written as it is lcm is 36 into 6. So here it is 36 into 6 minus 31 into 5. So numerator 5 by 36 as it is. Denominator is 36 into 6 and this is 216 minus 155. 31 into 5. Now we can simplify after subtraction this is 61 so 5 by 36 by 61 divided by 36 into 6 this entire thing will be multiplied here by taking its reciprocal 36 into 6 by 61 you can cancel these two now in the numerator 6 5 are 30 and denominator 60 1. So when A starts and the product of A winning the game is 30 by 61.